If you're watching this video, you're most likely someone that wants to stream on TikTok, but you do not want to use TikTok Studio because of course you might be someone that wants to stream on different platforms besides TikTok. Well, this video will show you how you can actually set it up and this also allows you to easily set up your multi-streaming on different platforms. So without further ado, let's get straight to what you need to know. Now, before we get started, this will actually work on both Windows and macOS devices. So yes, if you are someone that is like me that uses a macOS device to stream, this will allow you to stream to TikTok and it's currently one of the best ways to stream to TikTok on a macOS device. Well, for us to actually do this, we are gonna be using SC Live, which of course is Stream Element's own plugin and it's actually very useful and it helps you to actually manage not only one stream, but also manages all your other streams, whether you're going to be streaming to Twitch, Kick, YouTube, or all of those platforms at once. And of course, even TikTok. So first, what you're going to do is you're going to go to the first link in the description or just go to Stream Elements' own website and you're going to go to the AC Live page. Now, of course, download the plugin that suits your system base, whether you're going to be using Windows or Mac OS, which yes, of course, currently by the time of recording, Mac OS is currently in beta, but does indeed still work pretty well, and I've actually been using it for the past month. And once you have done that, basically once you open up your OBS, it should look something similar to what you see on the screen right now. Now, of course, I do have my own other plugins that I use for obviously getting some capture, and also for me to get some vertical clips for my gaming channel, but you'll notice that TikTok is not currently set up just yet. But you can see that you can also connect other platforms like YouTube, and there's so many ways you can actually use this plugin, which is very useful. But now let's actually add the TikTok output. So what you can actually do is go to your multi-streaming panel and you can click the plus sign. Now, of course, you'll straight away notice that you can actually add a whole bunch of different outputs, even some custom outputs. And you can even also add eggs if you want to stream on eggs, but obviously not much people really do it but you can indeed see TikTok. But basically what you're gonna do is you can click the TikTok output. And basically once you actually do add it, you'll basically just have to connect your TikTok account, which is straightforward, which is basically just signing into your TikTok account on your browser. But once you have that set, you are basically ready to stream on TikTok. But if you actually do hit that start streaming, you'll notice that your TikTok stream will be horizontal. Now, of course you could technically stream to TikTok horizontally, is something that a lot of users actually do, but you might be someone that wants to stream vertically. Well, let's add that vertical output. So what you're going to do is you're going to go to the TikTok output, you're going to click the three dots, and you're going to go to straight to the canvas. Now you can see it's going on default, which will be the horizontal, but what you're going to do is you're going to create a new canvas. Now do make sure the output is set to the vertical, because of course, if you don't, it will be in a horizontal format. So do make sure it is on vertical. Now once you actually have done that, you'll actually get a stream elements vertical canvas, which will actually pop up on your OBS. Now basically what you're going to do is you're going to just set it up the same way as your standard horizontal streams. So basically just add your camera, your gameplay, and obviously all the things that you do prefer to have on your streams. But obviously do make sure it is straight shot and does look clean for your vertical streams. Now you could technically go live straight away, but it will not go live on TikTok. That is because we did not do the new settings for the new vertical canvas. So to do that, you're going to go to the vertical canvas, you can go to the gear icon, and we're gonna go to the settings. Where you have the name of your vertical canvas, you obviously have the resolution, which should be set on vertical. And obviously depending if you are going to be doing streaming on shorts as well, you will see the output for shorts and obviously also your TikTok. But going down a bit further, you'll go to your advanced settings. Now, of course, if you are someone that is using Windows, you will be putting in the same output as you'll most likely have on your main horizontal streams, whether it's on Twitch, Kick, and YouTube. And it should be basically the same settings. Now, if you are someone that is actually on Apple, I do recommend to use Apple VTH264 hardware encoder, it does work the best. And obviously have your rear control on CBR. And I will definitely say, if you are someone that does want to stream to either two vertical platforms or just on TikTok, the recommended bit rate is around about 3000 or 4000. So I do recommend to put it on 4000, but obviously it does depend on your internet speed. And now you are basically set to go live on TikTok. Now, of course, once you click start streaming, you can obviously adjust all your titles and information for each individual platform, which is a nice little plus to have. But that is basically how you can easily set up streaming on TikTok. Now, let me say, if you are someone that is on a macOS device, the plugin will indeed be a little bit buggy on your OBS, which is currently one of the main downsides on macOS devices. But yet again, it is in beta and it will eventually get a lot better. And will, and will of course, eventually have less issues. But this is currently the best way you can actually stream on TikTok on your OBS. I'll definitely say by that time of recording, Atom did release their own suite, which currently is also in beta, but does not have the option to stream on TikTok. But I will say, if they do actually indeed add TikTok on that, I will do a video on how to set that up as well. But let's let me know in the comments below if this video helps you to actually set up streaming on your TikTok, especially if you are someone that is fresh into streaming. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed. See you guys next one. Peace, as always, and have a good day. Bye.